and was killed, that there would be some type of relief. The only thing was that I felt personally that I didn't find any relief. The United States has conducted an operation that killed Osama bin Laden. Those the words Michelle Rosado had waited so long to hear. The memories of 9-11 are never far away. She was at her desk on the 95th floor of the World Trade Center. Her camera captured images of the towers where she worked. This, a picture of co-worker Robert Chen, who didn't get downstairs in time. Just seeing everybody in such a panic, I said to myself, if our country really is being attacked, then we have to do something. We have to make a difference. Now, one year after bin Laden's death, Rosado told us one thing that doesn't change is the pain for so many. It didn't change anything. It didn't change the fact that people had been gone. Security experts say South Florida's airports, ports, and diversity make us a potential target for Al Qaeda. Florida Atlantic University terrorism expert, Dr. Robert Rabil, says bin Laden's death, however, has hurt their ability to attack. By United States, eliminating the Osama bin Laden and eliminating a good number of Al Qaeda operatives, that's exactly what happened. We have degraded the operational links between Al Qaeda and Al Qaeda affiliate organization. In the decade it took to find bin Laden, Michelle became an author and motivational speaker. He was a symbol of terrorism, but we all can move forward from that symbolism by just being ourselves and just knowing that we can move on from any type of tragedy. Rosado says, unfortunately, these days we'll have to always deal with terrorism. For more on her message on how you can overcome any odds, go to our website, NBCMiami.com. In Palm Beach County, Willard Shepard, NBC6.